At 5AI, we write software that uh, allows vehicles to self-drive in cities, particularly in European cities. Building self-driving car technology is going to massively relieve the congestion in our cities and is going to make it accessible to everybody and is also going to make it much cheaper. We're trying to replicate in many ways what we as humans do naturally. So we're trying to perceive the world with high accuracy and then we're trying to predict what's going to happen next. And then we're taking some planning decisions as to what to do. So we do this uh, you know, largely instinctively. When we try and replicate that with sensors and with computer technology today, it, it has many, many sources of error. And our job is to minimize those errors and to mitigate them and get to the point where we are at least as safe and hopefully in the future safer than human drivers. The current project that we're working on is called Streetwise. We have some academic input from University of Oxford. We're also working very closely with Transport for London. Obviously they have the ability to offer us access through the boroughs to trial of technology on their streets but they also have access to lots of traffic data and CCTV data and they're sharing some of that with us that allows us to build very accurate behavioural models of how humans behave in different semantic contexts. And then we've also been working with McLaren Applied Technologies and that collaboration is something that wouldn't naturally happen but definitely shows the convening power of government to make this happen more successfully. The European market in the future will be at least as big as the US market and that could grow to maybe 100 billion over the course of the next decade. Our question is, well, who's going to own that market? And if it's not going to be companies like us, it's going to inevitably be US and Chinese companies. So it's very much in our interest to configure the talent that we've got here and that way we can retain control of our cities and also make sure that the high value jobs and the high economic creation are retained here in the UK. Yeah.